Hey guys, welcome to another game review from me, a Um, and this is the game Dark Void. Um, I actually just got done filming my. I threw it again, down again. I just got d uh, done filming my um, Army of Two, my uh, 40th day review. Um, as I said earlier, I am just going through. Um, games because I'm leaving in a few days for college, um, but I'll explain that, I've explained that in my channel update. So anyway, Dark Ford. Um, first of all, I just finished, as I said earlier, like three times, I just finished Army of Two, uh, video game with you. I'm doing this one. I'm not doing Splinter Cell because I've started a co-op with Jaden on that. I want to get a full feel of the co-op though, before I give it a complete review. Um, I don't know. Dark Void was a very interesting game. Uh, of course, as you can see, he has a jetpack. Uh, if you have seen my uh, playthrough, uh, you s actually, if you haven't seen my uh, playthrough, go back, watch that through, um, and then come back to this. If you don't, uh, there are going to be some spoilers. Uh, if you don't want spoilers, you should probably get out. Um, I'll wait. So, people who don't want to be spoiled anymore, you should be out by now if you're not. I don't care, I'm going on without you. If you comment below, oh, I didn't want any spoilers, you didn't want me for spoilers. I waited like a minute. So, you can shove off. Anyway, Dark Void, uh, good game. The ending sucks, how she dies and everything. I really hated that. Um, I don't think that they should have uh, killed her off like that. And, like, in the end, it's like, it says, oh, you uh, can't get back, only the chosen one can get back through, but the Emil, or whatever his name is, I can't, that's how long ago I played the game. Um, really quick, I'm gonna see if they say it. Oh, yes. Uh, it was a 10. Um, yeah, after Tem, uh, Ava says that you can't get back, a Tem somehow gets through, I believe. And then there's Nicola Testa, uh, who I did like in it. I really think that choosing a uh, historical person such as Nicola Tesla is a really good match for the game. Um, a really good part in the game. Sorry. Um, I really don't have... My many bad things to say about Dark Void. I thought it was a great game. Uh, I love the flying aspect. It, I mean, it did have, it did take me some time to get used to the flying aspect, but after I got used to it, um, I enjoyed it immensely. Um, I threw the game down again. Whatever, I don't need it. Um, for the rest of the game, you get to fly around in a jetpack, except for one level, which was my biggest pet peeve about this game, is all of a sudden, oh, I have this cool jetpack, I have a cool helmet, I don't have to worry about these uh, for getting taken away from me. Well, you get captured, which I don't mind, but you have to spend the first part of the game without jetpack. And then it's just like, um, I've been used to this jetpack for ages. I have no idea why they take away the jetpack. Um, but yeah, uh, that I found extremely frustrating. So, uh, that's kind of brings the game way down, in my opinion. Um, so, from a game that I thought could have been an 8 or 9, it turns out to be a 7, because um, the mechanics are kind of difficult to get used to. Um, the guns basically did the exact same thing. Um, this is also going from memory, so I might be completely off. Um, what else? The end story didn't make any sense. The last boss frustrated the heck out of me. Um, and then the one level where you lo you lose your jetpack. Um, also, actually, there is one more. 
uh, the fact that he flails around after using the jetpack 200 times. It's just like, you should be used to this by now. Uh, I've used the jetpack before. Uh, you don't have an extreme recoil to the gun every single time you use it. Um, but yeah, besides that, a good game, besides the 25 million things I named wrong, I only named six things wrong with it. But besides that, I thought it was a good game. Uh, I do believe it's worth a buy. Uh, as I said, I give it a 7 on my scale. Um, yeah. Uh, see you guys in a later video. See ya!